Circuit 11 vandals continue to target Martin County Parks and the Sheriff's Office is trying to get a handle on it by making arrests. The latest arrest made just hours ago and WPTV's Megan McRoberts reports from Martin County. At Mary Brogan Park in Martin County. I, I've been coming here since I was a little kid. Reggie Lopez shows his son the ropes. Everybody loves him, so they just give him space and everybody hypes him up. He says there are a lot of children and teens who use the skate park here, which is also why he wants to see it stay nice. The Martin County Sheriff's Office, however, out here Monday, saying detectives caught a 21 year old woman from Port St. Lucie with bags full of spray paint just 24 hours after the park was hit by vandals, according to the Sheriff's Office. She told deputies she's an artist, but they arrested her on a felony criminal mischief charge. It's, it's a sad thing to see. Well, this has been an ongoing problem for approximately a year now. Detective Ben Lyle says this is the latest instance of vandalism within Martin County Parks. 22 incidents since just last year. While it's not known how many vandals are to blame, the damage is adding up. The county spending thousands of taxpayer dollars to repair toilets and sinks and cover up images, sometimes graphic or profane. And I adhere to the broken window theory. So once something is broken, once something is arrived, it brings more crime in. So if you start having things such as vandalism, the graffiti, it'll bring other deter other people to commit other crimes. Deputies hope by making more arrests, the park can continue to be enjoyed the way it's meant to be. For skateboarding. Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5.